Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. Today we'll be analyzing four cryptos which are Joe, Fetch.ai, Phoenix Global and Bitcoin. We will see where they might move over the next weeks. Please subscribe to our channel to receive our real-time training signals and our newsletter about cryptos, stocks, forex and commodities. Then you can join our growing community at patreon.com slash financial trading academy. Disclaimer, we trade on our own. We do not take responsibilities for your trading. Let's start with Fetch.ai. Here we have a weekly chart which will allow us to better understand what is going to happen over the next weeks. I do expect a very strong rise as of June, July. Okay, that's the window from where I expect a very, very strong rise for the entire July, August, September, and then a period of retracement between October and November. I've been uh, calling uh, during April uh, for a period of retracement, which actually happened, and that's because studying the cyclicality for the crypto market and taking into consideration mainly Bitcoin and Ethereum, uh, I've been detecting a 5.5 slash 6 year uh, entire cycle, which includes uh, four years for the ascending phase and 1.5 slash two years for the descending one that's related to the weekly analysis once we uh, zoom in and when i is the daily cycle then uh, i've been i've been uh, detecting a one year cycle for bitcoin and ethereum starting as of november 2022 okay uh, now inside uh, this annual cycle um, which would be over in November 2023, approximately, obviously, we can detect two minor six-month cycles, okay? That's why I was predicting a period of weakness during uh, uh, April and May. Uh, that's why, okay, moreover, I expect a very strong rise starting uh, in the, during the window between June and July. So uh, I strongly believe that the market is ready to skyrocket very, very, very strongly over July, August and September. And then again, a period of decline during October, November to start again a new one year cycle inside the four years ascending phase of the entire Gauss curve, which is approximately 5.5 slash 6 years for uh, Bitcoin that we take uh, as a, a obviously uh, point of reference for the entire market. Okay, so yeah, what we see here uh, is a huge increase in terms of volumes. Uh, that's why that's, this one uh, was the point of control and the red one obviously uh, was the second area from where the uh, sellers uh, started actually taking profit, uh, that's why we've seen, we've experienced this retracement. Right now, uh, we see a slight increase in terms of volume. So what is extremely interesting is that uh, during the period of retracement, we have experienced the retrace in terms of volumes. Okay, so uh, volumes uh, uh, kept going down, which, uh, which is actually a very strong bullish signal. Okay, now we need, uh, again, the upcoming uh, of new volumes, uh, but uh, analyzing on balance volume, I strongly predict that uh, .ai is going to uh, retake the 0 0.60 US dollar area over the next uh, weeks. Okay, so I'm, I'm strongly bullish on Fetch.ai. Um, it's in my uh, crypto pickup list. Uh, let's move on and let's analyze uh, Phoenix Global. For Phoenix Global, the uh, volume scenario is, is even better when compared with Fetch.ai, which was absolutely good. And the reason is given by this huge uh, volume that we see here, this, vo this vertical histogram, okay, uh, which is actually a huge support for the uh, downward movement that we have experienced here. Okay? So once hit in the 0.70 US dollar area, uh, Phoenix Global new kept moving down till uh, the area at 0 0.60 US dollar. Here we have experienced a huge incoming of volumes, and now if we observe the unbalanced volume, we can definitely state that the Phoenix Global new is a great buy. And uh, I believe over the next weeks, uh, Phoenix Global will be able to uh, retake the 1.50 US dollar area from where we will see a strong retrace. Uh, a 
of tweezing uh, uh, with uh, an alternance between uh, long white candle, long black candle, uh, reverse uh, pinball. But then uh, we are definitely going to break above the 1.40 US dollar for uh, um, new all time high, new new, uh, new all time highs. And in terms of targets, we can. Uh, uh, project the difference between the point of high here, the rectangle, and 0 0.60. So once breaking above 1.40 US dollar, we are definitely moving till uh, 2 US dollar, which is given by 1.40 plus 0 0.60, okay? Uh, which is the difference between 1.40 and uh, 1.80. Uh, let's move on and let's analyze Joe. Joe has a fantastic chart right now. Now, uh, we see here that that's Binance as a broker. Uh, here we have seen three, that's again a weekly chart, three huge volumes, okay? Uh, this one uh, obviously was a point of control from where uh, definitely uh, big ways were taking profit. Uh, yet, uh, we are now experiencing a new income in terms of volumes. Uh, um, over next week, I predict that the 0 0.60 US dollar, the 0 0.60 US dollar will be tested again. And then uh, definitely Joe is going to break to destroy the that area at 0 0.60 US dollar. And second area will be at 1.50 US dollar. That will be, uh, that's something that which uh, is going to happen. That's my idea. Uh, over the end uh, of the summer. Anyway, something uh, af definitely after June uh, uh, July, okay, because before we Joe will have to test uh, the 0 0.60 US dollar, it will be uh, not that easy, and that's because of the here the point of control. But I strongly believe that new volumes will be uh, coming very soon. Now, let's analyze Bitcoin. Okay, here with Bitcoin, we have a weekly chart, we have uh, actually a very clear idea of what. Uh, I've been stating in terms of uh, cyclicality. That's the weekly uh, uh, chart. So we have the entire cycles, okay? The, um, the entire cycle. So now we see here that we have uh, the red curve crossing above the azul one. Uh, so I've changed the parameters for the cyclicality. Here we have the manual cycle, and actually is giving out more or less the same signal, okay? Uh, for Bitcoin, I've been very clear during April and also during May and been stating that uh, Bitcoin is doomed to move till testing uh, the 23, 24,000 US dollar area, uh, which probably will be the relative point of law for the current period of retracing. Um, now we will, and, and then afterwards, obviously, we will need to see, uh, we will need to study the volumes, we will need to understand if whales. Uh, are coming back, uh, but definitely I'm strongly bullish on uh, Bitcoin, uh, and I believe during summer uh, Bitcoin will be breaking above the uh, area, the very strong resistance area between 30 and 34,000 US dollar. Okay, which is actually the the great wall that Bitcoin will need to to break before uh, going to test the uh, all time high uh, at 67,000 US dollar. Uh, right now, I'm testing uh, a proprietary new algorithm, uh, expert advisor. Uh, right now, the expert advisor is still uh, in uh, giving out a short signal, which started actually uh, here at 50,000 US dollar. So right now, the uh, my algorithm is not uh, giving out a buy signal yet, uh, uh, but probably it will be. Uh, uh, providing a big signal over the next uh, uh, weeks. Okay, guys, if you want to have the access to my algorithms, my expert advisor, which is possible to integrate even with the trading view, and obviously to our uh, trading signals and our analysis, then you can join our growing community at patreon.com slash financial trading academy. Thank you, guys.